Hey guys, Nash here back with another Android Pie Roam. So today we are going to review Xenon HD Roam. It is based on Android 9.0 and in this video we will review this Roam and I will let you know if you should install this Roam or not. So let's get started. So this is how the home screen looks from very first boot. It's very simple. It's not Google Launcher or Pixel Launcher. So this is a custom made launcher. And in this room you get some pre-installed very useful apps like Audio FX where you can tweak your audio. There is a music app here. And of course Xenon OTA where you can update your room whenever you have next update. Now let's go ahead and have a look at notification drawer. So here are some useful tiles and when you expand these, there are not many tiles to choose from like Resurrection Remix Roam and this might be turn off for many guys. Now let's go to setting menu to find out our features and as you can see all the features are packed here in this tab called Xenon HD Hub and when you tap on that, you can see Xenon HD logo, OT updates, change log from last update and of course your features and customization like status bar, quick setting and all kind of customization that you require in a custom room. So all these tabs has features like status bar, navigation, gestures, lock screen, power menu but when you tap on buttons and miscellaneous is empty. So I won't blame them as it's experimental build so it will be fixed in next few updates. So I have been using this room from last 3 days. And while using this room, I got two random reboots. Apart from that, the room is smooth, multitasking is smooth. Unfortunately, RAM management is not as good as Pixel Experience room. So again, as I said, this is an experimental build and not a stable build. So all the issues in this room will be fixed in next few updates. And now we are going to test this room's gaming performance. And for that we are going to play our favorite PUBG and as you can see I'm a legendary player in this game and the person in front of me is even more legendary <laughs> so he died. So I played this game for almost half an hour and it did not lag. The gameplay is quite smooth in this room, phone also not overheated. So I think this room is very good for gaming especially for PUBG. Now let's talk about the battery life. Battery life in this room is really good. I got almost 7.5 hours of screen on time and the standby time is great also. If you leave your phone 100% at the night, in the morning it might be around 97%. I normally got 96-98% to 98%, so only 2 or 4% drain overnight. So if you really want to install Xenon HD ROM, I would suggest install its audio version because the Pi is just experimental right now and wait for few weeks and then dirty flash this Pi build on top of your Oreo Xenon HD build. But that's just my personal suggestion if you really want to install this Pi ROM, I will provide all the links in the description box below along with Xenon HD Oreo builds. And before you go if you appreciate my work on this channel, please like this video. That is the only way you can help this channel right now and press the bell icon if you haven't pressed it yet. This is your friend Nan signing out and I will see you tomorrow. Ooh.